All right, what's up clowns? Welcome to the team builder for week nine of the GDL. I'm your coach of the Carolina Quagsires. My opponent for this week is Uncle Flacco and the Chicago Bear Ticks. So looking at his team, he's got a pretty threatening team. He's got the Heatran, Zygarde 10%, Excadrill, Celebi, Chansey, Alolan Ninetales, Mantike, Bear Tick, of course, <laughs> Hoopa, Gigalith, Hitmonlee, and I forgot the... <laughs> I forgot the name of the little dog guy, but um, he has a massive fighting weakness. Like, almost half of his squad is weak to fighting. So, um, we've got Keldeo with Secret Sword here and Kartana with Sacred Sword. So, hopefully we'll be able to exploit that a little bit. Um, he also has a decent fire weakness, although he does have Heatran, which does get access to Flash Fire. So, uh, I gotta be a little bit careful with my Will-O-Wisp. Um, but other than that, I think we have an okay chance at doing something this week, hopefully. Um, so our first mon is going to be Keldeo, um, rocking a timid max speed, max special attack, um, and the rest in HP with Hydro Pump. Hydro Pump is, it actually, if he's not a bulky set on the Heatran, it actually Okos. Um, or if he's like physically defensive, it Okos. Um, it also hits the Excadrill and uh, it hits the majority of his team at least neutrally for pretty serious damage. Scald there to get some burns, maybe on a couple switches or something. Secret Sword, um, like I said, hits Heatran. It also hits the Excadrill. It hits Chansey really, really hard. Um, it hits neutrally on the Alolan Ninetales. It hits Bear Tick super effectively. Um, it hits the Gigalith super effectively and the dog. <laughs> God, forgive me, I can't remember the name of that, that mon. Um, but yeah, it hits a lot of his team super effectively. And finally, Hidden Power Electric there uh, is for his Mantyke, or not Mantyke, Mantine. Um, it, it hits super, it hits four times super effectively, but um, it is a two hit KO because Mantine is actually relatively bulky on the special side. So next we have Bruno rocking the same set as last week Moonblast, Wish Protect, and Stealth Rocks. Stealth Rocks can come in handy. Um, because stuff like his Nine Tails, his Mantyke, I keep saying Mantyke, fuck, Mantine are weak to it, and those are some pretty bulky mons, so Stealth Rogs would be nice to have, although it's not like a necessity, I don't feel. Um, like if his entire team was weak to rocks, then yeah, obviously, but, um, so basically running the same set as last week, except for I think the EVs are changed, so max HP, max defense, rest in special defense. Next we have Snorlax, <laughs> Assault Vest again, nine weeks in a row. Body Slam, Earthquake. Earthquake is for the, obviously the Heatran, Excadrill, um, Hits Gigalith, uh, stuff like that. Heavy Slam is here for his his uh, Alolan Ninetales, his Bear Tick, um, and any other, I guess, frail, tiny mon. <laughs> um, and Pursuit is here for something like his Hoopa. Um, it would it would hit Hoopa really really hard and thick fat is kind of important here because of Heatran um, and if he has any other like ice beamers or his Alolan nine tails assault vest um, max attack max defense and the rest in special defense basically the same set I've been running all fucking all this league <laughs> um, so next we have Cartana with a Salic Berry we're gonna try this again with substitute. Um, the Salic Berry raises my speed at 1 4th HP. Leaf Blade, Sacred Sword, and Smart Strike. Uh, Leaf Blade for the... Basically the Gigalith, but it also has that crit chance, which I like. I think it also hits the Excadrill super effectively. Sacred Sword, I've kind of already gone into. It hits the Heatran, the Chansey. It hits a lot of his team, let's just say that. Smart Strike is basically for the Alolan Ninetales. Um, I think that's it, yeah. Uh, so, rocking max speed and attack with the rest in HP just to give my HP an even number for the substitute. Next we have Pringles rocking a fully specially defensive set this week, not trying anything funny. Um, Ice Beam, Scald, Recover, Will-O-Wisp with Cursed Body and Leftovers. Pretty, pretty standard set, honestly. And finally we have my boy Drampa. I went with Sap Sipper um, because his Heatran is one of his Z-Captains. So I was kind of wondering maybe he would run like uh, Bloom Doom Heatran, which is pretty common in OU. Um, so if I like predict that, bring in my Sap Zipper drop, but he literally can't touch me, and that will waste his Z move. So that's kind of what I was thinking there. Um, I really, 
I'm a little torn against Berserk, but I feel like Sap Zipper, if we get that prediction right, um, A, it would be a hell of a prediction, and B, um, it would put me in a good spot. So we're rocking a Calm Mind Roost, Hyper Voice, and Thunderbolt set, um, max HP, max defense, rest in special defense. So pretty bulky team this week. Uh, I mean, honestly, most of my team's bulky anyway, so the mons that I have to choose from, so... But anyway, I think we have an okay chance this week, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> I'm going to try to squeeze out at least one more win. That's what, that's all I want. <laughs> if I get one more win, then I will be happy, so <sighs> we'll see how it goes. I'm going to get out of here, guys. I love you. Peace out.